thankful for the last year that God has given us? Well, I think sometimes there's a uh, common misconception on how to answer that question. Um, people sometimes think that you got to answer it with some kind of catastrophic event. Um, oh, you know, God saved me from uh, an asteroid that hit my neighbor's house or something like that. That's, that's not true. Um, I'd like to answer it on a daily aspect. What he does does for us daily, really, um, and to be able to do that, I'll have to I'll pull out one example. Uh, about four or five days ago, uh, our hot water heater went out. Uh, literally, the bottom fell out. Huh? Mm-hmm. And uh, my sister was and two brothers were due to arrive like two days later. So mm-hmm. now we're scrambling. We don't have any hot water. We're, scared because <laughs> this is the first time out here I don't want to set a good impression but anyways I started thinking I'm like oh man Lord what am I gonna do now you know and it's gonna be a lot of money um, and we looked at our closing because we had purchased our home in January well in that was the home warranty and I'm like well it's probably not gonna cover it you know how mm-hmm. they have certain stipulations but it did so Benjamin Franklin, not that I'm promoting that company, came out and um, he said, well, it's going to be about $250 uh, on top of the $60 trade fee to get our hot water heater replaced. Now I'm thinking, I have a warranty on my house. Why is it going to be that much? Well, I guess it was to reposition the water lines or something like that. I said, well, thank you, but no thanks, because a hot water heater at Lowe's or Home Depot's $400. So <clears throat> they left, and uh, the insurance company called and said, hey, um, you know, we, we know you guys didn't want to uh, go with the, the plan there, but uh, we'll give you a buyout. So it'll take a couple hours, but we'll figure out a number and get back to you. So I went to Home Depot and I'm like, we might as well just get an Energy Star, or something that's gonna give us a little, uh, little more hot water heater, more efficient, and possibly some tax deductions too. You know. <laughs> so I did. I bought one and uh, got a hundred dollars off. It was an open box deal, mm-hmm. which was kind of cool. That guy was sitting right there for Mr. Paul. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I get it home, and I think the total cost was around $800, $830. Um, I've never installed a hot water heater before, uh, but mm-hmm. used to work aircraft maintenance, and I kind of learned here and there on buildings, you know. <laughs> but anyways, I got it home and um, started installing it, and the insurance company called me and said, uh, well, Mr. Walter, we're going we're gonna to pay you $900. I was like, what? Are you serious, Lord? I thought this wasn't going to work out. Next thing you know, uh, I got it installed, hot water heater, loving it. Adam says, that's the best shower I've taken in my entire life. <laughs> yeah. Pretty cool. Yep. But I'm a firm believer in the fact that our house was built in 2003. Why did our hot water heater go out eight months after we purchased the house? Mm-hmm. or nine months we only had four months left on our plan yeah. our insurance plan the home warranty yep yeah. home warranty so that was definitely a gift it wasn't a gift that i thought we were going to get i thought they were going to come in and swap it out and i don't mm-hmm. have to do nothing you know but no it wasn't it was uh god wanted me to install it he gave me a free one an upgraded one at that energy yeah. star and I learned how to uh, install it so not only did we get the upgraded hot water heater but now I know how to install it and um, I can use that to help others yeah that's true how about you honey um this year um looking back trying to think of you know what I'm thankful for what God has blessed me with this year um I really feel like um just the blessing of being able to move back close to my family after living away for 12 years. Uh, my mom, my sister, and her kids, and my stepdad, and 
I'm just so excited about that. And um, but when I was thinking about all of that, um, when I knew I was going to do this video, I thought about how God has blessed me even more than I had even was expecting because I was so excited just to be able to move back close to my family. But the relationships that He's brought into my life mm -hmm. um, since we've been in this area. Um, just the past year, um, everybody I've met here at Crossroads um, just felt so welcome right away. We were going to try other churches. We came here once and never left. <laughs> and um, I'm just amazed at how welcome everybody's made us feel and accepted. And, you know, we can be ourselves. We can be authentic and not have to, you know, um, put on a front and act like we're someone else. And we've just... Uh, received so much love from everyone here and for me I mean I just feel like God has really blessed me even more than I was you know hoping for or expecting even just like I said being being this close to my family again and then the added blessing of just bringing so many great people into our lives and um, our family has grown just the um, our close family has grown so much Adam um, mm -hmm. You know, he loves coming here to Crossroads. He loves the youth group and, you know, so excited every week to go. And he gets mad if he can't. So thankful for that. Absolutely. So um, our oldest son, who has walked away from his faith and kind of away from our family, um, just the relationship with him this past year. Yep. Um, he's seen how, you know, involved we've been with the church and he's starting to come around more and... Mm -hmm. So just even that relationship too, God has really blessed us with um, bringing our immediate family closer together, and uh, for that I am truly thankful. Absolutely. Yep. 